today? Good, good. I'm doing well, thank you for asking. So, my name is Fluidity. I will be giving you your checkup today. Yes, and this is just a routine checkup. You have nothing to be worried about. We just want to make sure that everything's still working the right way. Yeah, so you can just relax. Hopefully I'll be able to make this a nice experience for you. I will unfortunately have to get kind of up close and in your face for some part, so hopefully that's okay. Now let me just look over. Um, can you verify your date of birth for me real quick? Awesome, perfect. And it looks like the nurse already took your blood pressure, so we won't have to do that again. And now, the name that's written here, is that what you prefer to go by? Okay, good. Now, what are your preferred pronouns? Got it. Okay, so, that's the last of the kind of more bookkeeping questions. I just have a couple of questions about yourself and your health now, if that's okay. Okay, so my first question is, do you have any recent concerns about your health? Some trouble sleeping, I see. Now, what kind of trouble is this? Um, do you lie awake at night? Do you wake up a lot during the night? A little of both, okay? And how long has this been going on for? Just a couple months, okay? Well, I can do a bit of an examination today to see if there are any underlying causes of that. Um, that won't be very difficult at all. Hopefully we'll be able to get some answers for you. Yes. So, um, what medications are you taking currently? And that includes vitamins and supplements. Okay, so that's the same as we have noted from before. Good. And are those still working okay for you? Good, good, good. Now, just some lifestyle questions. Um, are you a smoker? Do you drink alcohol frequently? Okay. Yeah, a little bit is fine. You just want to make sure that you keep it in moderation. Now, what about exercise? Do you work out at all? Play any sports? Oh, really? I've been wanting to try that, actually. I'll have to see if there's any kind of beginner league, because I do not have the coordination for that. Okay. Well, that seems like that's the rest of our questionnaire, then. So, I am ready to get started with the examination, if you are. Okay. Let me put this to the side, then. Now, I do need to go ahead and take your weight. Are you going to be comfortable discussing that today? Okay. So, I just have this digital scale here. It was just calibrated, so I had to pick it up down the hall. And I'll just need you to go ahead and step on want to see the number, you can always just step on backwards and I'll just note it down. Okay, let's put this bad boy down and give me your hands. You can step on. Good. Okay. Let me just write that down real quick. Okay, you can step off. You don't have to look at it. Good. So, now is the part where I'm actually going to be kind of 
up close and personal. So I'm just going to go ahead and sanitize my hands real quick and I'll put on some gloves. You can just never be too careful at a doctor's office. Just listen to the da dun da dun da dun da dun. Give me a second just to listen to the rhythm. Just switch places a little bit here. Good. Good. Very healthy sounding. Now I'll just need to listen to your lungs. So I'm gonna start on this side and just take a nice big deep breath in for me. Good, good, good. And exhale. Nice and slow. Good. Switch to the other side. Big breath in. And out. One more time for me. Big breath in. And exhale. Good. Now, I'm going to go around to the back of you and do that same thing, just listening from the back. Okay. Okay. Nice, big, deep breath in. And out. Very good. And again, nice, big, deep breath in. And out. Awesome. Very, very good. Okay, yep, that's it with the stethoscope. It's all sounding very, very healthy. I can tell that you have an athlete's lungs. So. Let me just make note of that here. And then I will go ahead and start to actually look at your eyes, your ears, your nose, and your mouth. Okay. So, I just want to start out by looking in your eyes. So, I have a couple of pen lights here. And I'm just going to be shining them in your eyes a little bit at the same time. Just so I can compare the rates of dilation between the two eyes. It's not too bright, but it will. Mm, your eyes aren't gonna like it, I apologize. Okay, are you ready? Okay, so I just go like this. Good. And then like this. Awesome. And again, just like that. Good. Just watching them. Dilate here. Good. Okay, good. Let's let them rest for just a second. And now, I just want to look really closely into each pupil. Starting here, good, awesome, yep, good. 
good. Just keep holding your eyes open. You can do it. Awesome. That's very good here. Let's do the other. Perfect. Good. Try not to shine it in them too terribly much. Okay, now just comparing the two. that's it with this. So take a few moments and just blink a little bit, maybe close your eyes for a second, because then I'll need you to just kind of follow the tip of the light. Yep, just so you can make sure that that's all functioning fine. That really gives us good insight into your brain activity. Mm hmm Okay. Are you ready? Your eyes aren't feeling too funny? Okay. So, just switch with your eyes, just follow the light, or the tip of the light. The light isn't on. Okay, so just follow along. I'm just watching your eyes here. Good. Very good. Just keep following. You can do it. Very good. Going. In and out, and out and in. Perfect. A little bit more of the following. Yep. Perfect. Just follow that tip of the pen, tip of the light. Good! Nice job! So that's it for the eyes then. Now we'll move on to, I think, the ears next. We'll do those. So I'm just going to be shining my light in the ears, taking a look. If you don't mind, I might need to put my hand on your face just to make sure I get the angle right. Okay, so let me get really, really close here. one then. So let me just shine my light right in here. Just to see what I can see again. That all looks very, very similar. It looks very well kept up, so that is awesome. I don't see any irritation or anything like that. Okay. Have you had any issues with your ears lately? No difficulties hearing or anything? Okay, good. I'm glad to hear that. So I'm just going to move on to your mouth and then your nose. So if you could just give me a big ah, open wide. Yep. Now I just go, just looking at your throat. Again, just looking for any irritation or redness or anything like that. Taking a look at your teeth here just to see that you're keeping up with those too. Really looking back in the throat. Okay. Not too bad. Are you flossing? I know I'm not your dentist, but you're going to want to make sure you start flossing if you're not already. Okay, I'll let them chide you on that. Now I just need to look in your nose. So if you don't mind just tilting your head up, just like that. Good. So now I just look right in your nose. A 
looking for those same kinds of things. So any irritation, redness, excessive mucus. <laughs> I know it's gross, but I knew what I signed up for when I started this job. Okay. Okay, very good. Let me make some more notes. just kind of want to go ahead and start feeling some of your muscles, mm -hmm. especially in your face. I'll feel your lymph nodes and your sinuses. And then I'll want to test your arm's ability to raise and lower my arms. Yeah. Okay. Of course, with you being an athlete and all, I'm sure you'll have no issues with that. So let me just start out on your face then. So I'm just going to go ahead, let me feel your forehead a bit. Just looking for any kind of bumps, bruises, weak points. That's good. So let me move on to your sinuses. So, good, good. Have you had any congestion lately? Some allergies, yeah. I think I'm kind of feeling that here. But that's nothing to be worried about. It is that time of year. I'd move on to the sides of your eyes. there. You move around your jaw, feel your lymph nodes. Yep. Lymph nodes are a great sign of any infection, so I really want to make sure I'm checking those. Good. Now, there's nothing out of the ordinary here, but you do have a lot of tension in your jaw, so... I get the feeling that you're not letting yourself relax very well right now. Or in general, you're not taking the time that your body needs to really rest and regenerate its strength. That sounds right, yeah. We doctors, we know things. Okay, I'm just gonna feel your shoulders now. So when I tell you, please just shrug a little bit. Okay. So, let's feel those shoulders, so you can just shrug for me. Good. One more time. Okay, good. And now, I'll just want to see how your arms function. So I'm going to hold up my hands, and I want you to try to press down on them. Press down here. Okay. And I'm going to hold them the other way now, and I want you to press up on them. Okay, awesome. Well, that is all that I have for this section. But since I did notice that tightness in your jaw, I actually want to go back a little bit to your face and those muscles and see if we can get you to relax them a little bit more. Now, that's not going to be the underlying cause of your sleep issues, but it might get you a little bit of relief. Okay. So, I'm going to start on your forehead again, and I just want you to make a real angry face. Just really, really tense it up. And now relax. See? Let's try that one more time. Okay. Real, real angry face. And relax. And relax a little more. Good. That's a lot better than when you got here. Yeah. Let's do the same thing with the cheeks. So I want you to puff them out. Mm -hmm. And now I'll relax. Smile for me. And relax. 
and can you frown for me? Just and now relax. Let's do the smile one more time. And relax. Good. Is that feeling a little better? Okay, well, I'm going to come to the upper cheeks now by the sinuses. So, I want you to go ahead and give me a little nose scrunch. Just, yeah, as much as you can. Scrunch it all the way up. And I'll scrunch it more. Good. And now relax. Perfect, perfect. One more time. Scrunch, scrunch, scrunch. And relax. Good. I felt a lot, a lot of relaxation there. Last time, I just want to do your neck. So this one's going to be kind of weird. You're going to have to just try to tense it up as best you can. There's not really a face you can make. Let me just put my hands there. Nice and gentle here. Okay, now just try to tense your neck. You see mine? Yeah, like that. And now just relax. Good, 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 good. Okay. So if you're having trouble relaxing your body, I recommend doing these exercises with your entire body. Usually I start with my toes and my feet. I work my way up to my calves and just all the way up until by the time I'm at my head, usually I don't stay awake that long. Of course, like I said, I know a lot of different things can play into sleep issues, so hopefully I'll be able to give you just a couple of the resources. I can prescribe you another sleep aid, if you would like. Okay, well why don't we get you on a little sleeping mat, and you only have to take this one whenever you need it. It's not an every night thing. Okay, if that doesn't work for you, please just give us a call, let me know, and we'll try something else. Yes, sleep is so important, and I really want to make sure that you're getting enough of it, and that you're getting a good quality of it. Okay. Okay, well, is there anything else that you wanted to talk about today? No. Okay, awesome. Well, it was very nice to be able to examine you today. Yes. I can just go ahead, pop off my gloves, so that I can give you a proper handshake. Yes, nice meeting you as well. Will you go ahead, you try to have a really, really relaxing rest of your day. Okay, I'll be seeing you then.